Friday the 17th of September and I called at Little. And I was thinking, it's a, f it's a good few weeks since I was shopping at Little, And uh, I've noticed two or three of the prices have, have really gone up. Do you remember that soap, that I got four bars of soap there, own brand soap that I got for 69p. I noticed that that was a pound and nine pence now. Anyway, there was quite a bit reduced. And if you look, it's the 17th today. These sausages that they've reduced to 70p are actually dated the 18th. And the roast chicken drumsticks reduced to 70p. They're dated the 19th. I don't know that I can see a date on this. What does that say? Oh, the night, that's the 19th as well. And that was 70p, that's a live yoghurt. I got 15 eggs, they're 135 for 15. The chocolate was on special offer at 75p. The plain crisps are 85p. I'm sure I paid about 99p. I don't know if, if it was from Little. Anyway, I've got these with a view to winter and boosting my immune system there. Those are um, multi vitamin C tablets, 85p those were. And the Sunday blend coffee is at 179 so all in all there I spent £7.69 Sunday morning and it's half past 11 I thought I'd make a brunch with some of those chicken drumsticks, some garlic, half a stock cube I buy a bigger packet of sage and onion stuffing and it will keep forever well not forever but for months if you, um, it's just sealed with an elastic band is that and some apple. Bring you back when I've done it. I only needed one chicken drumstick and look at all that meat from the other four. And of course I've got the bones. This reminds me of going to York where you see those roast beef, roast pork and roast turkey places where you can get a sandwich. I think the last time I bought one, it was nearly four pound. Love going to a look round York on a Sunday. Apple. And some seasoning. We'll pop it on the top, I think. Lovely, cheap Sunday brunch. Wednesday the 22nd, and I've actually been looking for some more waterproof boots. Not for walking in, I've got walking boots and not Wellingtons, but just in case it rains. And I, I went to, uh, there's a designer outlet near York and there's a next outlet store there. And I got these, which were, they're treated with shower resistant finish. So, excellent. And they were actually, they're all fur lined as well. They were actually now £16. So I paid £16 for these. And when I got to the tail, it actually said, you know, you can ask how much they, they originally were. So I did. And anyway, the two sales assistant that eventually, well, one, the sales assistant that was uh, serving me, she, she couldn't find it but called somebody else over. Uh, really good customer service from both of them and uh, they have been £56 and I got them for 16 and then on the way back I called at an Aldi and I just got a few things um, it came to £7.87 
but I got these Wagyu burgers, uh, meatballs, 30% off. And if you look, they've been £2.99. And when I got my receipt, it was, she hadn't taken the 30% off. So when there was a bit of a lull in the till, I went back and I said, I don't think you've taken me the 30% off. Anyway, she looked and she said, oh no, I haven't. I haven't. So then she, she called a supervisor over and um, so I didn't get 30% off. She took me the, t she gave me a 2 99 refund, which is what they were in the original um, cost. And she says, I'll just charge you the 74p, which was the 30%. So I actually got 70% off these. I said to her, are you sure? So she said, oh yes, no, I'll sell you them at the 74p. So that was a bit of a result. My lovely new boots. And 74p from Wagyu Meatballs. And it's the 21st today. And they're actually dated the 22nd. So they'll keep for a couple of days. Excellent. Thursday the 22nd and by the time I got to Tesco's this week it was actually about half past five so it was a lot earlier than I normally go and uh, I went to the fresh section and these were the things that were reduced but they were still, I think they've done the second reduction but they were still quite expensive. The fresh bread had been reduced and they don't usually reduce it much more than this. So I actually bought a olive bloomer and a small French stick. And then I had a look at the uh, reduced section. Uh, quite a lot reduced in this uh, section, but the only thing that I really bought was some walnut pieces that had been reduced to £2.06. So I thought that was quite good value. I got the walnut pieces as well, and it was it was good to see that petrol had come down again. One sixty two point nine for petrol, and one seventy eight point nine for diesel. So it's come down a little bit. It'd be interesting to see how much it is around the country. So if you're in the UK, just uh, drop it in the comments section below, and let's compare prices around the UK. Take care, people.